Hi everyone. Today we're going to be doing an eye fixation hypnosis induction. The eye fixation hypnosis induction is one of the oldest known hypnosis inductions and for a lot of people it's one of the most effective inductions, for myself included. I find that I go deeper a lot faster and it's really, really good for people who tend to get bored by the longer inductions, who are quite well rehearsed with hypnosis, who know what to expect and are very willing to go deep quickly. It's also one of my most requested videos, so I hope you guys like it. And we'll get started in a moment. This induction is going to work best, of course, if you are in a room alone where you're comfortable and not going to be disturbed. You should be sitting upright, and ideally your screen should be slightly above eye level so that you're just ever so slightly looking up at the screen. I'd like you to make yourself nice and comfortable now, sitting upright, and I'm going to ask you to follow my instructions very carefully. I'd like you to focus on this necklace, bringing all of your attention to this necklace and just staring at it. Taking a long deep breath and just staring at the necklace. Allowing your eyes to drift around it, but always bringing your attention back solely to this necklace. Just staring at it. Allowing your mind to wander where it will, but always focusing your eyes on the necklace. And you may notice but as you continue to focus on the necklace, your eyes blink, maybe a little bit more frequently than usual. That's okay. Just continuing to focus on the necklace, always bringing all of your attention back to this necklace and keeping your eyes open. No matter how heavy your eyelids become. It's very important that you continue to focus on this necklace, listening only to the sound of my voice and keeping all of your attention on this necklace. And the longer you maintain your attention on the necklace, the more frequently your eyes close and you open them again, keeping your eyes open but you may notice those blinks get a little bit longer and a little bit heavier the longer you focus on the necklace, but it's very important that you keep your eyes open and you continue to focus on this one necklace and nothing else, bringing all of your attention to the necklace. Long deep breath. And as you continue focusing on this necklace, you may notice that your head becomes heavier and heavier. You may notice that the necklace blurs a little, becomes just slightly distorted, and that's okay. Just continuing to focus on the necklace, very important that you keep your eyes open, blinking when you need to blink, but continuing to focus on the necklace. You may notice that as the necklace becomes slightly distorted, it feels a little bit as though you're swaying back and forth, and that's okay. It's just your body relaxing, focusing on the necklace, keeping your eyes open. You may notice those muscles around your eyelids. And as they relax, they begin to feel heavier and heavier. That you keep your eyes open, no matter how heavy those eyelids become, those blinks becoming more frequent, longer and slightly heavier. You take long, deep breaths. And you look forward to the moment when your eyes will close, but not yet. It's 
very important that you keep your eyes open and continue focusing on the necklace. Keeping your eyes open and focusing, allowing the necklace to blur a little bit if that's what your eyes do. It may become distorted, it may even change colour a little bit. You may notice that your head is getting heavier and heavier, heavier and heavier. Your eyelids become heavy and sleepy, always maintaining focus on that necklace. As your eyelids become heavier and heavier until you allow them to gently close in just a moment, not yet. In a moment you're going to gently close your eyelids. Not yet. Continuing to focus on that necklace. Doing so well, taking those long deep breaths as your eyelids become heavier and heavier. And you allow them to close. Making yourself nice and comfortable. Closing your eyes. Taking long deep breaths. enjoying how nice it feels to feel so deeply relaxed, completely at peace, focusing only on yourself for a few moments now. I'd like you to take a moment to enjoy that peaceful feeling. You may continue to feel like you're rocking just slightly and that's okay. You're perfectly safe. Nothing is going to disturb you in any way. So just enjoying the peace for just a few moments. I'd like you to take a moment to think of one current goal that you have for yourself. Whether it's a small goal that you have for the day or something larger, a personal goal, a lifetime goal. I'd like you to focus on one thing now. One thing that you would like to improve. Just thinking about that one thing and understanding that you have the strength. Everything you need within you, you find in this peaceful space. You find absolute clarity, focus. And just thinking about that one goal, visualizing it now, whatever it may be. And you see yourself accomplishing this goal. You feel confident and strong. You are a confident person. You are a strong, capable person. You feel great peace right now and it feels so lovely, so peaceful and calm. Just enjoying that calm, peaceful feeling. Doing really well and continuing some more long, deep breaths. Feeling so clear and so focused. You have absolute clarity and it feels magnificent. Appreciating this time you have taken for yourself, how good it feels, understanding that it is very beneficial to you and to your goals. Feeling the benefits of taking just a few moments to rest peacefully deeply and feel completely at ease, deeply relaxed. In a moment I'm going to count from one to five and when I reach five you will be fully emerged, fully aware, feeling calm but confident and ready to take on the day. One beginning to become more aware of the sounds around you. Two, feeling calm and peaceful, but more and more aware. Three, feeling refreshed and invigorated. Four, you may open your eyes whenever you're ready. Five, your eyes are sparkling clear. You feel full of energy. You are fully emerged, fully aware and ready to take on the day. Well, I hope you enjoyed that eye fixation hypnosis induction. As always, please feel free to let me know what you think in the comments below. And I hope you have a great day. Catch you soon.
few people asked me recently if I'm on Facebook. I am not on Facebook. I am on Instagram. I am Sydney Alley on Instagram, S-Y-D-N-E-Y-A-L-Y. I don't post very many hypno-related things, if any. It's fairly personal and if you're feeling stalky, you might want to get on there. If not, that's fine. I'll see you on YouTube. And we're just going to wait for the neighbours to leave the apartment building and not keep closing their doors. I forgot. Hypnosim Hypnosimus. Hypnosimus inductions. Cool. That's new. Hypnosis inductions. Hypnosis inductions. That's a lot of times to say hypnosis induction. You ever go to say something and you just have no idea what you're about to say? Yep, that's awesome. I should really find a hypnotist to help me with that sort of thing. <laughs> 